This is something you can start to lose. Syrian crisis stops to hold on to the world without it. Wants to hold on to the world without it. Wants to hold on to the world without it. No peace. Says this, this, this peace treaty on the board. Truce. Truce between all the factions. Maybe they can work out some kind of deal to get them out of Iraq and Syria. I don't know where he will send them. But he holds on to the world without it. He holds on to the world without it. He holds on to the world without it. Meantime, his people are dying, being slaughtered, being genocided, being butchered, being dead, and being, being raped, being sold into marriage. Where is where this guy of any conscience? This guy of any conscience. He holds on to this little, this little safe zone. War without it. War without it. That's all it is. It's war without it. It's a Syrian crisis. It's a war without it. It's a war without it. There's no end in sight. There's no end in sight. As the terrorists continue to strike, as he continues to strike, the Syrians' people, 13.6 million Syrians displaced. Because they have nowhere to go. It's being slaughtered. So they have to get out of the country. They have to get out of the country. People want to come back to their homes. They want to live in this area. They want to live in a nation that's peaceful, quiet, not blowing up everything, bombing everything, killing and torturing everything. The Assad holds on to his war without him. This is something you make the start of losing. Thank you for watching.